food and naughty. Calories all through your body like a 12 gauge shoddy. Back with another bodega edition. Today we got a drink. I like doing these drink reviews as well as food. And um, but this one right here, I don't know what they're thinking. Now mostly when you think of watermelon, don't even think about it. Don't say it. I know what you're thinking. But not on this can. Now this was found at the bodega. It's a soda, naturally and artificially flavored. Uh, simply watermelon. That's the flavor. It even got an email uh, account right here where you can email them. Right on the can. You know what I'm saying? Marketing at its best. You know what I'm saying? You got any questions, go ahead and email. But look at this can, man. They got the little Caucasian young man with the biggest piece of watermelon I ever had. Look like he got an entire watermelon. You know what I'm saying? Look like he got the whole, yo, don't cut it. In matter of fact, cut it, but give it all to me. You know what I'm saying? Just give me all that. I want all that. I need that. So, if you enjoying this big ass watermelon that much, I think I might be enjoying this can. But I don't know. We're gonna see today. It's made by a company called uh, Kawi. C-A-W-Y. Um, ooh, Miami, Florida. So here we go. Straight out the bodega. Zero total fat. Uh, 50 grams sodium, 50 grams of carbs, and 50 grams of sugar, no protein, 200 calories. Let's get right into this Simply Watermelon Bodega Soda. Ooh. Oh man, I ain't got no fingernails. Ugh. Nice, delectable sips. <sighs> Kinda remind you of a, uh... What's that? What's some cans? Hold up. If we're being honest, when you first drink it, it tastes good. It reminds you of the, uh, the Fagos. Y'all remember Fagos? Shout out to Detroit. It reminds me of Fago at first, but then it tastes like it's been in the factory for uh, 15 to 25 years with hella dust on it, and somehow the dust settled into the can, so it's like a dust aftertaste. If that makes any sense. That's what it tastes like. Uh, I don't know why he's so damn happy on the cover. He shouldn't be. But maybe it's because he got watermelon and he didn't have to drink this. Maybe that's why he's so happy. Let's see if I still get that aftertaste. Yeah, that aftertaste is terrible. If they could have cut it off at the beginning, it don't taste nothing like watermelon either. There ain't no signs of hints of nothing of watermelon in this in this can. Terrible. Food and Adi, not approved, and food we trust, but not in this cola, or soda, or whatever you want to call it. How you say, how you say no in Spanish? I know yes is C. Si. I should have looked that up before. Whatever it is, y'all let me know in the comments. But this is no CC. Nada? Is it nada? Whatever. No. You, no. We're out. That's in the review. Turn, turn the camera off. Get the camera off.